so uh, dead of winter, I'm walking down the street with the one CD that has been ordered on the website, and it's minus 30 in Ontario. It's cool. And I'm kind of semi-accosted by the new breed of kid who, that the organizations hire to, to, to get money. And uh, they don't just sort of ask you for the money. They, they run up to you and they, hey, nice jacket, nice coat, nice thing. Hey, man, uh, you look really cool. Listen, uh, we're raising some money for they can engage you like that, right? So this kid's doing that. And as soon as I, I tell him that, I, that he, he gets on me musician, his face changes and he says, he says, oh, man, you're a musician? I said, yeah. And he said, uh, oh, you know what, man? I was, like, wondering... Like, I don't know what to do right now. Like, I really love music. I love doing it and stuff. But should I, like, do it? Like, full time? Now, it's 30 below. I got one CD that's been ordered in the past three months. And I'm going to mail it. And I'm looking at this kid and I'm thinking, what do I say, you know? So I realize at that moment, and I tell the kid that I realize at that moment, I said, you know, at one point, this thing that you think that you love becomes just a consequence of choices. And the romance of the thing doesn't matter anymore. It doesn't, it's not a cold thing. It's just that it just is simply a consequence. So just choose carefully. So music doesn't mean anything to me. It came to mean everything. Oh, the rich and loveliness. It's the one thing that I've protected in my life when my marriage was falling apart. It was uh, inarguably always there as I had kids and as uh, other people were kind of falling by the wayside. And, and complaining about how much their kids took away from the time. I mean, the songs would keep coming. Again, it just felt like a consequence of, of, of a choice that I didn't know I made. You live and you die and you'll never get that sense of what your echo is. And the beautiful thing about being a, an artist is that you make things and if you're lucky enough, you release, you sort of likely release these things, you let them go out into the world. And if you're lucky enough, you hear an echo of the thing. And it, and it's, uh, it affirms the fact that you're alive. And of course, and if you can get paid for it, all the better, as the saying goes. The jarring 